Hi, my name is Mary Zild and I would like to share with you some ideas about project work in the classroom and curricular integration. I'm sure that all participants in this learning event have got some kind of experience with e-twinning projects already, but let's still go through some specific points. Well, all projects differ. They, there could be short one classroom projects or projects between different classrooms carried out in the whole school or between different European schools like we do in e-twinning. Projects could be short term or longer term. So short term projects could last up to a day or a month and longer term projects a year or even several years. When we as teachers think about the benefits of projects, there are a lot of them. But I would like to point out a few that I feel are the most important. Uh, first of all, projects help us to stress learners' creativity, to bring it out. Through projects, we are able to develop learning skills, especially those that are connected with the 21st century learning skills. Of course, projects give huge motivation to students through interest in content, especially when they are able to pick a theme. They develop learners' auto autonomy and develop social skills through communication and collaboration. And when I think about project-based learning, I'm quite sure you agree with me that project-based learning is an active process. During this process, students question themselves and research to find answers. And teachers here provide opportunities. So actually, project-based learning uh, develops from teacher-centered learning towards student-centered learning. And teachers here provide soft scaffolding, giving help when necessary and not intruding much into the process of learning. And project-based learning, of course, relies heavily on group work and student experiences. When I think about different projects, there could be theme-based projects and they based simply on a theme or topic being used in the curriculum and curriculum-focused projects. They are based on the curriculum content areas designed to enrich and teach students. When I think about theme-based projects, it could be quite easy to find out a topic to use in project work. But somehow, it's not very easy to fit it into curriculum as different topics and different themes are taught in our schools at different times, even in different school years. When I focus on curriculum-based projects that we base on the curriculum content areas and especially on competences, it is much easier to fit in. Well, if I, let's take into account curriculum-based projects. We could uh, find integration through general competences. First and foremost, communication and, so and social skills. I'm quite sure uh, the importance of these skills uh, is stressed out uh, in different countries' curriculum. Well, when I researched Estonian school curriculum, I found out that notions such as tolerance, cooperation and group work skills, research skills, and 21st century literacy skills are the ones that could be effectively developed through different project activities. Uh, of course, you can find also integration through subject goals. I myself am a foreign language teacher and uh, thinking about subject goals in foreign languages, then uh, uh, the most important goal of uh, foreign language is 
student interest in learning foreign languages. This could be motivated uh, through project work in a very uh, fine way. Also, if we want to develop in foreign languages students uh, uh, listening skills and writing skills and speaking skills, these are all uh, are actually developed during these different projects. Uh, when I researched our uh, curriculum, then I found out that the project-based learning, the word itself, has been pointed out in different areas um, at least a dozen times. The ways how to integrate ICT into career cu curriculum was pointed out even more. So, I would like you to think about your curriculum, maybe browse through it once more and find out how your country's curriculum encourages the implementation of project work and ICT integration. And I mean through general competences, learning outcomes, particular subject content, and so on and so on. So let's try to start a discussion on our curricula.